Hello again. Today we're going to be looking at one way in which some consonant sounds are different from others. Okay, then let's have a look at these two sounds. Okay, how is s different from z? Do what I'm doing. Okay, so what's the difference? Uh, when I say s, I feel vibration in my throat, and when I say s, there's no vibration. Okay, and where does that vibration come from? It's come from my voice. Your voice? Yeah. Okay. So can you tell me the difference between s and z? With s, we don't use our voice. That's right. So how can we make this sound if we aren't using our voice? Mm, the air is coming from our lungs. Okay, and this sound? Z. Uh, z. We use our voice. Okay, correct. Okay, so there are two different types of English consonant sounds, voiced and unvoiced, or some people call them voiceless sounds. Okay. Okay, so here we have all the consonant sounds in random order. Ling, I want you to help me find some of the unvoiced sounds. Okay, so g. Um, voice. Voiced. Very good. S. Unvoiced. Unvoiced. Excellent. Unvoiced. Okay. B. Uh, voice. Voiced. Very good. T. Mm, unvoiced. Unvoiced. Excellent. Okay. Hmm. Mm, voice. Voiced. And. Mm. Unvoiced. Mm. Mm. Uh, voice. Voice. Excellent. Okay. And. Shh. 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 Unvoiced. Unvoiced. Excellent. Very good. Okay, that's all we have time for today. Well done. Okay, it's time for the Apollo question of the week for Zanchi readers. If you answer this question correctly, you win not only an Apollo t-shirt, but also an Apollo backpack. Okay, so the Apollo question of the week is this. Send us three words to the email below, each with three different voiced consonant sounds. And another three words, each with three different unvoiced consonant sounds. Good luck.